How are we today? It's pretty slow, you know? Only 18. Double. Yeah, that's a nice, uh, yeah, nice fish. Okay, we're out here at Pony Cove. We got Demarcus Hall on the boat. Marcus on the boat what that means is if you are a salmon it's not going to be a good day for you not today Pro probably not we're out here trolling we're getting close to the butt crack we always catch a fish at the butt crack there it is be ready okay get ready you can't not catch a fish here we're on. Maybe? I busted them off. That second hook set, I felt it. Uh. Okay, a little bit of chaos. Kind of hard to film, but we got uh, two salmon and a rockfish already. Yeah. Coming in hot. 11 okay. more to go. 11 more to go. Let's go, buddy. Oh, it's got to hurt. I told you. We told you it was a bad day to be a salmon. You shouldn't have done it. I think that might be, this is a chum. Oh, it Check is. it out, this is a chum. So it look is. at the big pupil. Yep, yep. And look at the tiny skinny layout. It is. This is one of my favorite fish, the chum. It is. And uh, a lot of people think chums are terrible fish. They don't eat them, but they're actually delicious. I love them. One of my favorites, probably top favorite. So good job, Demarcus. Yeah. Okay, we're on another one. Oh yeah. Here, Marcus, hold this thing. Right. Nice Trying one. to bait up. Nice Got one. one on. On, maybe. He's on, right? Yeah. Okay, who got him? Okay, step back. Get him on here. Oh, nice silver. This way, this way. Oh, we lost another one. Dang. Still got, we got the a, bait though. Okay, let's get another one. And fish on in the background. Yep. They are around the boat. I... Oh, no, do not spool our lines. Purposes are all around us. Purposes need to go away. Maybe, oh, there it is. You on? Okay. Yep. 
Yep, tore his head a little bit. That's okay. Let's take a line. Okay, yeah, we got that on the turn. It made a turn. So many times you make a turn, you get hooked. That's exactly what happened. I started to make a turn on this thing and Looks like a silver. No, I'm pretty sure that's a silver. Or no? Nope. Chrome silver. Silver. Just a nice silver. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Double. It's rough. We got doubled up. Let's go. Right there. Coming in. I have to let go of the camera to to net this thing. Oh, double. There he is. What are we gonna do now, Demarcus? We got no net. Two fish, no netter. Holy crap. How are we going to do this? I got mine. Okay, I'll watch you. I'll hold on to mine. Watch you net it. He's in. Yeah, it's a nice silver. In gently. That's, that's some skilled hands right there. Most people can't do that. Okay, now you can net mine. Wait, you want to club him first? Go ahead and club him first. Whoa, big waves. We're about the only ones out here. It's rough today, but it's hot. Okay, it's step back. See this professional netting job by a professional guide, Demarcus Hall. Here we go. Oh crap, that's a good one. Right. I'm not doing my job. Let me reel in a little bit here. I'm trying to can't do a cameraman and. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, here we go. Ready? Coming in. Got him. Oh, it's a fatty. Holy moly. That's a nice one. Ooh, okay. Ooh, that's a nice one. He choked it. Yeah. Ooh. Let's get this thing up here. Take a look. Oh. Smack him. There he is. Beauty. Okay, so that's a Jack King. That's got all four species. He's got a King, a Chum, a Pink, and a Silver. Right now we got about eight fish. But I don't think I'm gonna keep him. I'm gonna let him go. But see, he does. the limit of Jack King is high. What is it, you know, 10 or something like that? 10. And fishing game doesn't like these because what happens with Jack Kings is they come back a small male and they're mature enough to compete with the females and what happens is they just make more jacks and they compete with the other big males so I'm gonna try and release them gently anyway okay. 
All right, this is the Jack King. Got black in the mouth, black spots, black tail. Just gonna let him go. I'm not gonna keep him a little small. They're not that great eating. Fishing game, they're, they're, the, the limit is 10 of these things. But uh, I'm gonna let him go. There he goes. Double. Oh no, mine's on though. Okay, here you go. I put it in neutral so it's kind of swimming randomly. That is a big pupil. Yep, you're right. As soon as you bonk it, that eye goes. Shink. Yeah, that's a nice, uh, yeah, nice fish. I love the chums. We're getting there. What do we got? Nine. Nine. Nine salmon. So we've been getting hitting right on top of the water as we're letting out, and it looks like there's this flotilla. There's bait or something under it. The salmon are just nailing them on top of the surface. Crazy. Let's see if we can get another one here. We just got two hooked up right on top of the water. Oh, oh, I felt something. Had a bump. Okay. Marcus has got one on. Oh, I I think I'm on too. Hold on. Maybe. Mine's off. The, mine's off. I can't tell. No, I, I don't think I have a fish on, but I did. I had a, had a hit. But yours, you got one on. Let me get the net here. All right. Net. What's it look like? Think silver. Okay. Coming in. Oh yeah, it's a good one. He's still hot. Oh, downrigger's in the way. Oh, nope, back further. Lost him. Damn it. That downrigger's in the way. Oh, this one took it pretty hard. Oh, it just got off. <laughs> laughing at me. <laughs> oh man, that's like the tenth one we've lost. I know. Yeah. I told you the Marcus Hall was on this boat. You shouldn't have came in. That's what you get. See? You shouldn't have done it. That's what happens. Okay, hey, Demarcus, here we are. Uh, how do we do today? It's pretty slow, you know? Only 18. Yeah, I know it took about a couple hours here. Look at these guys. There's a mixture of mostly silvers, some chums. Can you point out a chum? Chum right there. There's a chum right here. Look at him. 
difference between the silver and the chum. So you can see the difference in the eye. Yep, right. Tell me what else, Marcus. The tail. Right there. Okay. So that difference in the tail, you can tell, is uh, that's a thicker. That's a silver, and it's real skinny. It's a chum. Then you can go back to the mouth and the blackness around the lips. Uh huh. All white on the chum. You're right. Right. It looks like he's we got a pink over it here. So well, wait a minute, tell us a little more about the chum because it uh, it changes. This is not what a chum looks like when people see in the rivers. No, when it starts hitting fresh water, there's stripes that go down the sides. They look completely different, don't they? Yeah. It's a gorgeous fish now. Can't really tell. No? Yeah. Really good eating. And a lot of people don't know about chums. There's another one. A lot of people don't think the chums are good. One of my favorites. Actually, we had a taste test last week. One pink. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, we got pinks also. Uh, show me a pink. One pink. Right there. Yeah. This is the pink. Yeah. You can see he's got spots on the tail and the, um, the scales. Yeah. So this is a two-year-old fish, and these are four-year-old fish. You can see the scales are half the size if you look really close. Um, they're all really that, good. And the scales come off real easy on the pinks. Scales come off easy on silvers, but they come off even easier on pinks. Yeah. So DeMarcus, I've known DeMarcus since he was a second grader. I co started coaching him in basketball back then. The only thing he would skip practice for was what? Fishing. Fishing. Two Every greatest time. things in the world. Him and I have that in common. We both love fishing and basketball more than anything in the world. And now DeMarcus is in his fifth year of college basketball last year and he's getting a business degree and he's going to start his guiding career so he's already a professional guide right now and um starting it off so if you ever want a good guide demarcus hall scriven and he's up here in anchorage and uh, we'll try to give you a link to that yep at the bait shack yep and that's the trip all right it's a good day in the bottom of the sea